Oh no, we crashed. Hi, I'm Ona, a Finn who grew up in Luxembourg. I met my other half, Temo, when I lived back to my roots in the north and together we decided to move to Paris and marry in Normandy. After having lived in several continents, countries and cities, we were done with the constant change of landscape and wanted to settle our family. The question was, where? Being in love with the center of the old continent, we decided to pick the best of as many places as possible and moved right in the middle, in the land of three countries where France, Germany and Luxembourg meet. After having visited several houses in 2018, we finally found an old Maison de Maître that was in desperate need of love and care. We began its renovation, doing most of the work by ourselves. The house has plenty of room, so we invite people to help us out and inspire us in our projects. Even this channel was started by a creative push from our friends. Come along and enjoy the ride through renovation, gardening and learning about a piece of history in the east of France. Good morning everyone, I just woke up and I'm hearing noises from outside. I guess he already started. It's 9.15 in the morning and he's already clearing the yard. I guess I better go join him. So it's later in the day and I went to do some grocery shopping with mom and we came back home and look at this. Okay, the people who did see my stories this week on Instagram know what a mess this was um, in the beginning of the week. But them woke up very early this morning and he has been doing a great job in the backyard and now I really regret that he had he did not take any footage on how everything looked before but I can just guarantee you that it was an absolute mess we had all the construction chaos in here as you can see even the grass has not been able to grow because it was all of this was a uh, construction waste that we had from our bathroom renovation and now he's been sorting out all the mess to the back of the house so that well first of all it's not so visible and second of all it's already nicely collected into piles wood mixed waste metal and here we have this is actually from the construction work that we did for the neighbors. Uh, their old wall is there. So yeah, now we just have to get rid of all of this and bring it to the Deshi tree. But everything is nicely now sorted out. And also the grass is nice and short. My flowers are coming up. I just had a look at these tulips. They are absolutely gorgeous. I love the color of them. Very beautiful. These tiles we found laying in the house in different forms. These are uh, original tiles uh, from the house that I believe at some point after the war in the 50s, 60s. They have replaced them with a new type of flooring and gladly they've saved some of these tiles. These tiles are from Villeroy Bourg and it's very badly visible here but there is a stamp behind where it says Villeroy and Bourg um, X V I I I so they are original from the 1860s when they actually started the production of of these tiles 
and they were inspired um, by the archaeological findings in the area very nearby to us, where archaeologists found ruins from old Roman times and uh, Roman baths and Roman villages. So that's the story how the collection of these Villeroy tiles began. And I hope we can use the old ones to replace some of the original ones that have been destroyed in our ballroom, which used to be the shop of our village. I found other uh, tiles um, from our atelier. These are not so beautiful from the front, they are just uh, single colored ones, but the stamp at the back is much more visible. So here you can see Villeroy and Poch Metzlach XXVI. And I am wondering now that maybe this number has something to do with the production batch um, that the tiles have come out because they all seem to have a different numbering in them. This one has a, a, a simple IX and this one is XXVI. So I really have to figure that out. I will have a look what that means. But nonetheless, these are all um, 19th century tiles. Very interesting. I will keep you posted. Okay, that's enough of the tiles. I will start doing some trimming. I bought this very nice tool a couple of weeks ago and I actually figured that it's a really, really handy tool and it allows me to very quickly trim all the around all the fences and all of my flower beds, etc. So it comes really handy. I used to do all of this um, manually by hand, <laughs> which led to the fact that I had my hand really ruined always afterwards, because we do have quite a lot of places like this to trim uh, in the backyard. So it's just better that I could get one which is electric. Let's start. See how quick it is. I am so satisfied. So we got a swing for the kid for his birthday. I think it, it's this model here. And uh, it's been already a couple of weeks that the swing actually came, but uh, there were parts that uh, were not uh, in the package or they were just not part of the swing, which was quite unbelievable. Uh, we didn't think of it, but these were the anchorage part parts. And so we haven't been able to put the swing up. They are supposed to arrive today. So hopefully we'll be able to start putting the swing up today. That will be much fun. swing is finished and it's really nice now we have a playground for the kids kids here they can enjoy and have fun dinner preparations we have some meat here that we have spiced up and we're going to uh, put it in the barbecue and I made some potatoes um, with garlic and some rosemary and cream and I will roast them in the oven and for dessert today we have a great tiramisu made by my mom it's pork with the dry rub and what do you have in the dry rub uh, sage sage has dried uh, mint has dried uh, Finnish forest mushroom dried onion dried garlic dried um, pepper uh, 
salt, one chili, uh, ginger, dried. I think that's it. It's like being a child again. Thanks for watching. See you in the next video. Stay happy. Bye for now. It's like being a child again. Oi! Oh no! We crashed!